Hey guys, good morning. It's your friend Sebastian. Foundation 1440, Wednesday. You might think that it looks light out here and it's pretty well dark. And I stepped out of my workout to join you guys because I was listening to something awesome and I got super inspired. And what's funny is yesterday, my amazing executive admin, Michaela, and I were talking about what we would post today and trying to get out in front of it. And then Wednesday, we do business tips, tricks, hacks uh, to, to build an extraordinary business, right? And the purpose of business is to fund the perfect life. And so what's so funny is, is I was on the treadmill and taking a break to do some ab rollers. It struck me that today's subject, which is always be looking for your replacement, um, it just hits me from from every angle and what you find out guys as you do as you really get into this is there's not that much if you're an entrepreneur there's not that much separation between uh, your business and your relationships and uh, the most important things and your wife or spouse you know significant other your family right all the important things I need to know about being an amazing business person seem to fit well into being an amazing husband and being an amazing dad and being an amazing leader. And so guys, these tips, tricks, and hacks, it, it kind of doesn't matter what day it is. Uh, but on the business end of things, what we were talking about is always be looking for your replacement, guys. And um, this is good news, bad news, right? You're always looking for your replacement because if you're sharp, you're trying to surround yourself with people that are better at this than you are, that are smarter than you are, that are maybe even more motivated, certainly more focused than, than you are, right? At least in my case. And, you know, replace, like looking for the person that can replace you guys. I am true. And then if you're hearing this, make no doubt, this is a great message. I'm looking for that person that looks at me and goes, yes, you know, my life sentence is I aspire to inspire people to do what inspires them. I want you to get up and get out and get after it. Do what you want to do. Do the thing that creates passion in you. And I love real estate and real estate is a, is a way to wealth and I'm really good at it. And I want to find my replacement, right? Because that person will run my company. They will run Nest Property Group at Keller Williams Realty better than me and they'll be more focused than me right and that will free me up to be in my sweet spot and my sweet spot is inspiring so if I could inspire somebody out there to come and take control of me and make sense of this please message me right I'm always looking for my replacement guys and you know I think about our friend I have a friend back east and he's a baller absolute baller in the financial world I mean he's one of those top 100 maybe in the country in the world we're talking following in Warren Buffett's footsteps this guy is amazing and he has a beautiful family two beautiful daughters and honest to god you guys he works so hard and he's so focused that his health is just deteriorating he he passed out the other day and took out a table in front of his daughters and when I tell him that he needs to get some balance and this and that and the other thing there's pushback and when I share with him that there's somebody out there that he, he should be he should have already found his replacement hi gorgeous he should have already found his replacement right I don't he, I think he probably knows logically somebody out there's got to be as good or better than him at it and what he's not doing is making it his job to find that person instead he's just clenching through it right because he he knows how amazing he is and he is uh, but he would be even more amazing if he found his replacement, right? Because then he could then he could step back and let that person shine, right? He could mentor that person and let them shine, and they could take some pressure off him. So, guys, you're always looking for your replacement. And uh, how I got that, the, that passion and inspiration from listening to a podcast 362 on Bigger Pockets about uh, – a personal retreat with your spouse and creating a huge plan around, uh, you know, a big life with your spouse. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here we are talking about tips, tricks, and hacks on Wednesday at Foundation 1440, which is always be looking for a replacement. Surround yourself with people smarter, better, stronger, faster than you, right? Get them where they want to go. You'll get where you want to go. Guys, and I... I failed in this in the last year. I had people better, stronger, faster than me. 
and we had some drama and we didn't and my leadership wasn't where it needed to be and now i got to go find the next people that are better than me right i grow people and uh, if i'm not smart enough or a good enough leader to keep them they may move on and and i'll take great pride in watching them go and crush it in the world right and today i know i'm still looking for my replacement so i hope that helps guys there's always somebody better than you go find them give them an opportunity create a huge life you'll feel much better about it i promise to you and your success